in this lecture we are going to go ahead and you know discuss few questions related to probability so this is going to be a good way to go ahead and revise probability to revise joint probability density function take the first question it says consider two continuous random variable x and y with joint probability density function which is given as this 2 by 81 x square y for x between 0 to k and y between 0 to k and 0 otherwise it says find the value of k for which f of x y is a valid joint pdf let's try this one can we do it so see because i have to go ahead and keep this as a valid probability uh, you know joint pdf i know that when i integrated over all values of x so x goes from 0 to k and all values of y y also goes from 0 to k the probability density function dx dy integration should give me 1 so when i integrated over all values of x and then over all values of y that should give me one first of all i will integrate it over all values of x just this part so this will give me 2 by 81 is just a constant so i'll keep it aside integration of x square will be x cube by 3 from 0 to k and then whatever answer i will get i will integrate that from 0 to k over y okay One. From here, I will get two by eighty one k cube by three. Integrate this from zero to k, or y dy, and equate it to one. Now you know this entire thing will be a constant, so I just have to integrate y. So I will get y square by two from zero to k. Two by eighty one k cube by three equal to one. So when I solve this, I will get two by eighty one k cube by three k square by two minus zero equal to one. So I will get two by eighty one k to the power five by six is equal to one. so the value of k will be 1 so this just gets cancelled into 81 to the power 81 into 3 to the power 1 by 5 so this is 3 to the power 5 to the power 1 by 5 so this is 3 so the answer for k will be 3 okay now write down the second question 